working on towboats, working on barges, working in a physically very beautiful place on the Mississippi River. It's hard to get better than that. It's just in my blood, I love it. You know, I seen him working over across the river one day when I was probably 10, 12 years old, and I always wanted to do it. I asked my dad if uh, he could get me a job on the river, and he said, yeah. So I started going to work with him to see what it was all about. Finally worked my way up to the pilot house. So here we are. Stop here and run to the other end, or what? I don't know, between the two of us, we can top around. That's what I do. Roger. The barge can carry the equivalent of 15 rail cars or 60 trucks. When all three modes of transportation work together, we get our best efficiencies. Commodities that we ship are all things that don't have to move fast, but have to move far and be loaded into a barge in Savage, which we will move from Savage to St. Paul, where we'll build that barge into a tow of, of 11 other barges and leave St. Paul. And in New Orleans, all those barges will be transferred into ships. Off they go through the Panama Canal to Asia. Most barges empty weigh around 250 tons. I can take barges completely up to land for repair and then send them back in the water and turn them into fine cargo hauling vessels. You know, I've, I've seen all types of people do this, but you would think it would take like a, a farm kid, really, somebody that's grown up with hard work ethics. At the end of the day, you've got the job done. You've got something you can physically put your hands on and say, I did this, I accomplished this. That's the good part about this job. Every day it changes. <laughs>